so here uh, like uh, STDs uh, children might be uh, watching so I won't get into uh, uh, crispy details as I'd, 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 I'd get <laughs> So uh, this is a protection a protection device. It uh, you could you could I I I work at some place where you had uh, something similar looking where you put it on your finger uh, because you're protecting yourself from uh, bad substances or you're protecting others from uh, bad things that came can come out of you. So uh, this is a protection. It could be a glove. It could be something else. So you're protecting protecting yourself here. The yourself would uh, no. Sorry, this is outside the telephone line. I thought this was a Ethernet, Ethernet cable. This is the outside. This is the threat coming in, and this is inside. This is your computer. So you're protecting here from there. Here, right here, you're. I, as I told you, you can get the virus from a traditional support as this. So you're protecting protecting your computer. That will be this part from that part. It has uh, the package here. Uh, that same thing here is there. So I'm not gonna get into crispy details as I uh, told you before. So uh, let let me open that uh, spy bot for you to uh, have a have an idea what it what it looks like. I will close this. I'll pause while it's loading because it's a bit intensive. So here we have spy bot search and destroy. The first thing we want to do is because uh, a bad malintentioned people outside out there are trying to get you the most they can, so they're trying to flood uh, the internet with the most recent, uh, with things more recent than uh, than it's already there. Most of the time they do a very small variation, hoping that the uh, uh, basic very basic, uh, less than uh, what I have on my computer. Will not get it. Will not get it. Will not have. Uh, uh, will not be smart and will not understand that it's only a variation. And then they will need a digital signature. And this is how you would get it through a search for update. First thing you do is search for update always when you when you have a security software. After this, you will search and destroy. You will click here, and then you will make a list. And after, if you see some is infected, you will then go into recovery. Uh, you will select which one, and then you will recover them. And then you, finally, once once it's recovered, you will go here, and then you it will uh, show you from from the previous previous processes. It will show you which are unprotected. So uh, I think uh, it's because I didn't do search and destroy that it's, it will not show me that I have none unprotected. So probably if I do search and destroy and it finds one, it will show me show you that it's unprotected here. So I will select the one that has unprotected, then I will immunize it. So the browser here is uh, Firefox. I'm not using Internet Explorer, but as I um, as I mentioned, uh, I'm not sure if it's before in this in this uh, tutorial, but another one, uh, the default um, default uh, browser for the operating system Windows is Internet Explorer. So even if I'm not using uh, Firefox actively when I'm browsing around through computers, so let's here it would be like a browse or look look for uh, a computer threats. I would use it. It would have an intern browser right here instead of this window, and I would I could go around the internet and browse through browsers. Uh, it will li likely have a default home page. It would show me show uh, the the ones that I can browse uh, viruses or threats, and I would browse through it. And while doing this, it would use either uh, the 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 software browser, but that would mean much bigger. It would mean like 10 or 20 megabytes more. And uh, most softwares are small, like 4 or 10 megabytes, so it will be a lot bigger so uh, they don't want to do that and they might they might as well only skip th that part or have two versions one with the browser and the other one without the browser but what most uh, software do is say hey they're using Windows right away and they have an internal browser th th it's Internet Explorer but it might be something else they might Windows might have uh, another in internal browser whatever the case they use that internal browser so they will use uh, Internet Explorer. So even if your uh, browser is you're not actively using Internet Explorer, you want to block 
uh, protect yourself against uh, Internet Explorer. So let me gather my thoughts. Good thing I thought a bit more. Uh, the the other way, uh, the other thing that it could could do with active protection is get a, a better uh, antivirus that uh, uh, the free one I'm getting. The, uh, as I sorry, sorry. When I click here, it, it's I, it's a second time. When I click here, it advanced slide. So I'm coming going back to the slide to the other slide. <laughs> so as I. Uh, I uh, showed you before it, it was a button here it show it showed you complex threat protection and then you had the button here uh, get more it, then I would show me the non free the payable uh, AV AVG uh, uh, antivirus protection but um, I I don't want to do that I don't want to pay I don't have uh, enough threat I don't have en uh, enough precious things on my computer to to go this far I can very well have a virus for 24 hours I can live with it because uh, a lot of viruses uh, they found out that if you uh, the more you annoy people the more chance you they'll have to get people will want to get rid of the virus so they want to annoy the, the just enough so they make a profit or they have an advantage out of it but not enough so they'll want to uh, eliminate the, the threat the problem sorry because it's already infected so it's a problem they that they want to eliminate the problem so you see so most viruses they they don't want to uh, annoy you so much that you'll either remove the antivirus or you completely format your computer and uh, when you do so you'll, you'll be gone for sure so they they want to uh, have the problem on your computer as long as they can because they'll make a profit or they'll know uh, more things about you longer so uh, yes because so on my my computer I don't have enough uh, precious things that I'll, I can't live with uh, 24 hours most likely a non-destructive uh, uh, problems on my computer so on the next uh, segment we'll talk about uh, software choices